we present Glimpse, an animation technique that smoothly transitions between markup code and rendered documents. Producing and editing documents using markup languages has become a familiar task for computer users. But to visualize how their changes affect the document, users typically have to render the document explicitly, check it visually, then come back to the text editor to fix possible mistakes. We introduce a new technique called Glimpse that lets users quickly preview documents within the text editor. Pressing a hotkey smoothly transitions to the rendered document and releasing the key switches back to the editing mode. The user can then regularly check the document without disrupting editing flow and quickly get back to the editor to keep working on the code. Here, a professor is using Glimpse to update her teaching schedule information. The smooth transition helps her follow the parts she wants to modify and then find them in the HTML code. She can quickly get back and forth between the code and the HTML page to make changes and check that her changes are correct. Additionally, the context provided by the animators allows users to identify mistakes in parts of the document that are not their primary focus, as for example the typo here. Animating the whole viewport also helps users maintain a mental map of where pieces of HTML code end up in the HTML page. Using other preview tools, it is more difficult to get a quick overview of where pieces of code end up in a document. Synchronized side-by-side -side views, for example, require scanning all elements in sequence and splitting one's attention between two separate windows. They also require more screen real estate. While the code is being edited, Glimpse compiles the document and computes the animations on the fly. A gray light in the status bar switches to green to indicate that the animation is ready. Then it switches to blue to indicate that the animation has been pre-rendered to make it smoother. When crossings occur during the animation, it can be more difficult to follow elements. To make it easier, an option allows to have them take curved trajectories. Seeing these crossing motions can help find anomalies in the document layout. Here, the user can now see that the paragraph she deleted caused a table from a different paragraph to jump to the wrong section. To fix this, she scrolls to the table and edits its placement options. After checking that the problem is fixed, she can return to where she was initially working. After the animation, users can scroll the document and Glimpse animates back to the piece of code corresponding to the new region of interest. Glimpse uses a scrolling stabilization mechanism that automatically pans to the document region corresponding to the part of code being edited. Here is the same animation with a motion blur. Glimpse can benefit a wide range of markup language users and can also be used for educative purposes, such as in website tutorials. This example illustrates how Glimpse animations can help users understand the complex syntax of LaTeX formulas. We have presented Glimpse a quick preview technique that smoothly transitions between document markup code and its visual rendering within the text editor itself. This technique can be used as a complement to classical side-by-side -side preview tools. It addresses the split attention problem, takes less screen real estate, and offers a rapid overview of code to document mappings.